morning everybody, we're gonna be taking Jake out for the first time into the ocean. We dipped it in a little bit earlier, but now let's try to go way steep. And Today we have a mission to find shoes. Now that we're in the province, I gotta find new Spartans. So let's go. Okay, we made it to Caisano in Mobile Town, about 20, 25 minutes away from where we're staying. We have to pick up some vegetables for Shirley, helping her film out a video. I think the rain is coming. It's getting quite dark. You know what the nice thing is about being here now rather than the city is we don't have to wear that damn pass. It's like huge paper, but now it's just more freedom, more relaxed. Such a good feeling guys, such a good feeling. Who's this? Stairs. Paint a uh, turtle there. What? Turtle stairs. Oh, and the fishes. I've never been here before. So there's two Kaisanos in Moabal. This is the bigger one, I think. This is quite big. We're in the province. We have like a super big grocery. Whoa! It's huge. This is way bigger than the other one. Calamansi! Nice one, let's try that. Calamansi fruit sosa. One of my favorite here. I love calamansi. Look at that calamansi. Guys, this looks more safe than in the city. This is more prepared here. one from Gaisano. Look at this one. Yeah. And turtle stairs. Cool. Okay guys, we are in the center of mobile. This is usually a much much busier than it is now, but for obvious reasons. <laughs> but uh it's a tourist town. One of the most popular towns for tourists in the Philippines. So it's a bit quiet now, of course. Oh, look at that, guys. Peanut butter. Hard to smell it through the mask, but... Mangosteen, right? Mangosteen, new fruits out. But we're gonna try to find uh, slippers, Spartans. Hello. Hi. Where did my girlfriend go? Yeah, oh, there she is. <laughs> Thank you. Do you have uh, Spartans? No, Spartans. Yes. How like... much Spartan that? Spartan 95. I made it cheaper. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
What size is this? 11. Okay. Oh, perfect. 90 pesos? 95. I'm your 100. I buy it. The original price is 100, but you in 95. In Samar, I buy it for 60 pesos. In Samar. In Samar. In Samar. Or cheaper. In Samar. It's from Negros. They make it in Negros? Yeah, from Negros. Ah, we learned something today, guys. The Spartans are made in Negros. Okay, I'll get this one. Perfect. Whoa! I've never been here before. Look at this market, guys. That's amazing. What? Why we never been here? Look at that. There's so much stuff here. Are you serious? This is really amazing. Holy moly. This smells good, guys. I love this smell. Mm. We've been searching for broccoli all day long, and everybody was saying there's not available, but there is one here in the market. Look, we found broccoli. How cool is this? Mango, sir. Yes. How much is kilo? 120. 120, that's uh... So 120 off-season mango, I think that's pretty good. We'll come back, we'll come back. For Can sure. Thank you, ma'am. Guys, this is crazy. I had no idea about this market. This is way better. This is huge. Banana. Banana queue, ma'am. I'll have uh, one. This one. Oh, it's hot. If you need energy, guys, you'll see this all over Philippines. It's the best. Successful trip here in Mobile Town. It's very nice to come to one of my favorite places of the Philippines. We have a lot of friends here that we haven't said hi to yet, of course. This is our only our second day. Well, one and a half. We only came in late yesterday but uh, it's been a pretty fun successful didn't expect to see such a big market even despite us having lived here in mobile before so you never know what you're gonna see and find here in the country and by the way it's been super busy getting all the paperwork and heading down packing and all that moving still haven't shaved both my beard and the hair that's coming that's coming I can't wait to cut this off. It's so annoying, guys. All right. We just made it to Cabo San Falls, and when you're driving here, there's like a bunch of Kenya rearing shops all over the road. Tons and tons of them, but this is the entrance to it right now. And uh, it is open to some degree. It means that you have to do this uh, bracelet thing, tracking and book it online ahead of time. Okay, we made it back and look what I got. This is part of that, it feels so comfy. Even if they're really hard, that just means they're gonna last a lot longer than the uh, softer, nicer, more comfy ones. In the end, these are gonna be the most durable one, cheapest, and last longest. And by the way, Sun, for the first time in six months or so, red lobster, red lobster. Hey, what are you doing? I'm making me a video for my century tuna challenge, even we are here in the province. So what are you actually cooking? I'm making a century tuna broccoli satay. We're gonna have a lovely province meal over here. Um, Shirley's cooking something and we're gonna bring it to the edge of the resort where we're gonna enjoy probably the sunset and have a lovely snack. Yes. It's I a am meal. so hungry. It's a meal. Do you see how red I am now? Yeah, you're lobster. I'm lobster. 
Oh, and we also forgot to eat the dragon fruit we got yesterday, mm -hmm. so I'm excited for that as well. Dragon fruit, promise! <laughs> yes! <laughs> I'm so freaking happy, guys, you wouldn't believe. Never yeah, feel like we're in a province life, freedom. Gosh, amazing. It's the best. Alright, we just finished up wrapping a video for Sherlyn. This is what she came up for Century Tuna, her uh, patching that she's going on now. Brett, do you smell something good? Where's Jake? We have to get Jake, he's, uh, he's taking a nap. Yeah, it smells good. You're gonna have some later. Pretty good. Mm. And The calamansi fruit soda from Testo. I never tried this one before. Maybe it's just sold in the province. Have you seen it? Mm. I think we need the Kojic. That's really good. Yeah. Kojic. Mm. Guys, yesterday there was a gloomy afternoon, but I think we're gonna have a spectacular sunset. Can't wait. Whoa, red, red. <laughs> it's so <laughs> cute. Look at it. Drag. Oh, he oh, likes it. Oh, nice tuna. Makes you strong. No. No, Jake. Come here. This is what I was saying about Jake. I was spotting him, he just went out to the ocean here and he was storming towards something, but uh, he listens pretty well. Come here, Jake. Good boy. We might have to tie him up during low tide or something because he will be gone. Off again. Look at that. Mmm. <laughs> Mmm, that is so good. That is better than candy, guys. Wow. No, no, Jake. <laughs> no, no, no. Up, come here. Up, up now. <laughs> work in progress, work in progress. <laughs> Yeah, he's so excited. He's been running around here, having a time of his life. <laughs> what an incredible sight here, ending off the video. We got the sun going down just behind Negros mountain range and the clouds, so probably not gonna catch any good colors, but fascinating scenes with so many people here gathering some uh, foods I guess snails crabs all sort of uh, things that just grow right in front of them and the feeling of being here is so surreal compared to the last five or six months in the city it doesn't feel like this virus thing is going on at all in this world the province life it's almost like you're reborn here and it feels amazing guys anyone that's out there back in these lockdowns I feel ya I feel ya In the meanwhile, hopefully I can make some uh, positive videos showcasing the province life, nature and some beautiful shots around this area of the country. Life is beautiful guys. Let's make the most out of it. <laughs>